Well, good morning. Welcome to our ramble today. As you could see, we're going to be starting at Staveley. Well, usual welcome at Happy Mount Park, and it's over to you, Bernard, to tell us where good we're morning, going. Good morning, Norman. Morning, Bernard. And as you can see here, it's 6.25 miles exactly, exactly. but over a thousand feet of ascent. Mm. So yeah. we'll all feel better for it at the end, <laughs> if not tired. Some of us. <laughs> okay, so we're parking close by Staveley, which is here and we then walk uh, along the ace don't ignore the arrows because i'm going the other way around we walk along the uh, the road here and then up this very very steep you may remember it uh, hill and uh, in this direction here up the fell further and eventually to brow foot where we were on the day of uh, the Kentmere walk. We went, yeah. we came down this road, but uh, this time we'll just do down a little bit and follow the river. This is the Kentmere road here. Yeah. But then we go across the bridge and we start to go up the fell. You can see the contour lines here. So it's up, 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 oh. onto the top. And then it's all downhill. Yeah. <laughs> all downhill, down here, down here. Okay and eventually back to the car park yeah so really good and I, we promised a little bit of rain uh, sunshine today but no rain so we'll see how we go we'll see how we go very good okay thank, thank you, you. Much. thank you right we know where we're going so everybody gather it up and then we'll be on our way it was my birthday today so i've been giving out all the chocolate bars which is what we do every time somebody has a birthday, they provide the chocolate bars for everybody. Anyhow, here we are. We're walking down the road now. This is the main road that leads to Windermere. So we're going down here just a short way and then we're going to turn off here now and then start climbing, as he said, up and up and up. And this is the start. A few styles to go over as well. The weather's like overcast and uh, at least there's no rain at the moment. We have blue skies and cloud. Hopefully it might stay like that but uh, we'll see what happens. So, up we go a bit more. Just have to keep getting my breath back and then we'll set off again. Quite handy having the camera because I can stop and have a video around and then move on again. A train there on the point of Windermere. A fine body of men. Now Ken and Peter bringing up the rear, apart from me behind them now. And a bit of a dike in the bottom here. Oops, no, I don't want anybody falling in. Right, we'll just uh, come across from one style to another and we're going to have dinner, our coffee break here. Then we'll go back out onto this road and we're going to go down the road. But we're having coffee time now. Well, that was coffee time and we're off. Nice white horse there. Dogs, a Labrador, I'm not sure what this other make is. Or breed, I should say. So, we're going upwards again. Twelve of us on the walk today, 
so they over the, over the styles a bit quicker than we were when we, the other week when there were 17 of us. Oh, just have a look at the countryside. As you can see, it started raining. So we had to have a stop and start putting the cagoules on and wet weather gear. As you can see there's rain getting on my lens now so we might have to stop video and if it doesn't uh, pack in. Well, this was a bit of a a steep bit coming down. The only trouble is when you come down, more than likely you're going to have to go back up again. There's loads of crab apples on this tree. One year I collected a load of crab apples, but it's a lot of work doing something with it, so I don't bother another year. Right, we're making our way down to, to the river now. Land drain in there. Man been taking his dog for a walk, and here we are walking down the side of the river. Eventually, we get to the bridge. Here we are. We're on the bridge now. So we might just have a group picture there as well. That isn't us. I just like to use the big horns on that sheep. So here we go, up again. Bit of a pull and the path just a bit uh, not so clever really, but at least it is a path. Is not as bad as last week's when we were going through it. Oh dear, the clouds are coming in again, so it looks like we could have some more rain. But we we'll just have to face it if it does. But we haven't had dinner yet, so hopefully, we get dinner before it comes on again. The clouds are gathering. a bit ominous but anyway this is there was a lead mine just by where we were I didn't, didn't actually see the entrance into it but uh, that's what it showed on the map anyway this, this is dinner time just a quick look round we were quite fortunate it didn't come so we we're all right and now we're on our way again So now we're making our way back towards Stavely now. It's uh, an, an old ice house, so we were told. There's like shelves inside for putting your whatever they will put in, meat and things. So this is the road that leads to Kempmere, so we're just going to turn off now and go back into the fields again. Picking a few blackberries there. Trying them out. Oh, a lady coming on a horse here. fascinated with this wall that's right in front of us going right up that countryside how straight it is oh, clever building them walls like that we 
nowadays they probably had theodolites and things, but I don't suppose they did then. This is uh, where there's a pharmaceutical works somewhere around here. There's a lot of I just thought I would leave that on. Nice to hear the water running. So, upwind again. So now we're almost at Staveley. And we're going down another path that will lead us near to where we part. We're part at the edge of Staveley rather than in the centre. So we're cutting the centre out and going on this other way. So I come down here and we're going to turn right. There's a far chappy root breeding yeah. these cocker spaniels. Gamekeeper, he came up and chose that one there. He just brought him uh, out to have a run around. This one, somebody's cancelled on. Still talking to him for a bit. Which is a bit annoying, really. It's yeah. a cracking dog. Yeah, he yeah. likes uh, apples. Huh? <laughs> well, the bitches do. <laughs> Dogs are all right. Mm. They're walk the wall. Yeah. I was saying, he just had one left. Huh? And somebody gave yeah. backward on the one. English. So he, he wanted one for 450 pounds he wants for it. can't stop here all day, we will have to go again, but it was nice just to have a, a look at the dogs playing. So, on we go. So we get to the end of this lane and then uh, we should be a lot nearer to the cars. Uh, Peter Hall, uh, the uh, joiner there. So, now we're at the junction where we just turn right and our cars are down the lane. I think it was the old old road uh, years ago until the bypass was put in. So anyway, here we are, we're back. So I hope you've enjoyed your time with us and we'll hopefully see you next week. So it's bye for now. <laughs>